As Google Fiber Hoods pop up throughout the Kansas City area, the city is on the path to becoming the most wired city in America. But there are thousands of people who aren't going to be reached because of their lack of access to the Internet. As Jenna Hanchard explains, one group is working to fix this so-called digital divide. Rosedale 1013. Angela Rodin wishes life was a little easier. If I could just leave out of my house and walk across the street to the library, wouldn't that be awesome? But she can't, and public transportation doesn't reach the doors of the Rosedale Ridge housing complex in Kansas City, Kansas. All she wants to do is surf the World Wide Web. In some ways, the internet is almost becoming a utility, like the telephone, like electricity, like water. Michael Limata, president of Connecting for Good, is working to bridge the digital divide. The group set up a free Wi-Fi network at Rosedale Ridge. They offer residents free computer training and inexpensive refurbished laptops. Limata says these tools will lessen the divide between the digital haves and have-nots. I have been an educator for 30 years, and I know that Nothing lifts people from poverty like education. Roden spends Fridays and Saturdays at the internet training workshops. Only recently did she get a voucher for a used computer, but figuring out how to use the internet isn't easy. I would give up on even being on the computer. You know how you're like, oh, I can't figure this out or I can't find this. Literally. I would get so discouraged. But thanks to the work of Connecting for Good, Rodin is slowly becoming more confident, strengthening her link to the digital world. In Kansas City, Kansas, Jenna Hanchard, 41 Action News. It's an inspiring story. Now, Connecting for Good is always looking for support. If you'd like to donate, you can reach out through our website, kshb.com.